Hi, my name is Victoria Castle. I'm a geology major at Stony Brook University, class of 2024. I'm working with Dr. Maureen Fun in the Department of Geosciences in the College of Arts and Sciences. This summer, my research was using luminescence dating on two fluvial terraces in the Udorica Valley of Poland in order to reconstruct the chronology of the paleo environment. So the luminescence dating technique is used on grains of buried sediment in order to measure the last time they were exposed to light. The really cool part about this technique is that it's used on buried sand and therefore can be applied anywhere around the globe and beyond. My work is part of an international and interdisciplinary project that gathers together archeologists, geologists, and geochronologists like me. My specific project is to contribute to the knowledge of the Udorka River and its sedimentary deposits and put a date on the chronology of when the deposits were placed in the Udorka Valley to see if it aligns with the time in which people were transitioning to a more sedentary agricultural lifestyle. By the end of my project, I'll be able to give you an exact depositional age just based off of a pinch of sand. I've always had an interest in science, and I think my curiosity to my family, who has always been super encouraging and pushing the boundaries of knowledge and learning. Additionally, I love to climb and hike, which has given me a vast appreciation for the breathtaking forces that shape the Earth's surface. My goals for the future are to apply to geology PhD positions for the fall of 2024. I hope to find a lab that allows me to take an interdisciplinary approach to global change research. My areas of interest are geochronology, geomorphology, and climatology. In a changing world and unpredictable climate future, I feel the urgent need to understand more about Earth's surface processes and climate change in order to protect marginalized communities from the brunt of climate injustice as well as the environment. The Vallejo Fellowship was an incredibly enriching part of my college experience. It allowed me to continue research full-time over the summer while financially supporting me through it, which I wouldn't have been able to do otherwise. In addition, it gave me the opportunity to contribute to the knowledge of global change. I would like to thank the Francis Vallejo Fellowship Program and the Panafail Foundation for supporting my research experience this summer. And I'd like to thank the College of Arts and Sciences faculty and staff for making this collaboration possible. In addition, I would like to thank my mentor, Dr. Maureen Fun, and my mentor, Taylor Granfield, for supporting me this summer.